Hey everyone, in this quick video, you'll see how to set a completed and expiration date on a MemberPress course certificate. If you're not sure how to get started offering certificates on your MemberPress courses, check out our full tutorial on how to do that. So here on my MemberPress website, I have an online course built out right here. And you can see here that I'm offering a certificate of completion on it. And then here in another window, I have this course's certificate open as a test user. So here's what that certificate looks like right now. So if I go back to edit the certificate as my site admin, here in the certificate tab of the course, at the bottom, you can see three options. This first one, completion date, when it's toggled on, will show the date a student finished the course on the certificate itself. And when it's toggled off, it won't show it at all. So if I toggle it on, and then click here to save the changes. Going back to my course as that test user, I'll refresh my certificate, and you can see the completed on date added here. And then going back to edit my certificate, the next option is enable expiration date. If you toggle this on, it'll display expires on and then a date that you can set here. So you can set a time in the future in days, weeks, months, or years. So for example, if I set one year here, it'll display the expiration date as one year from the day the student completed the course. And here, there's another option to reset the student's course progress when the certificate expires. So in this case, they'd lose all their course and quiz progress and would have to retake the course again to get the certificate. So if a student has already finished the course and then it expires, the link to download their certificate would disappear and they'd have to retake the course all over again. So I'll go ahead and enable this and then click here to save the changes. And then going back to the certificate, I'll hit refresh. And then now you can see the expiration date one year from the date it was finished. This could be useful if say, you have an online language school or test prep academy of some sort and you're running an online accreditation program. You can make it so students have to retake your course and quizzes every so often to keep their accreditation up to snuff. You can make them go through the same course and they just retake all the same quizzes to show that they still know their stuff. Or after the course expires, you could update it with all new information. After all, what good's knowing a language when you're not up to date on all the hip new lingo? Or maybe you're a business using MemberPress for an employee training program. Let's say you're an auto mechanic shop. You could use MemberPress courses to train up your employees. And like the cruel and evil boss they all know you are, expire their certificates every few years and make them ace your course all over again. Not just to torture them, but also to prevent disasters on the shop floor. Okay, so going back to WordPress, I just want to show you one last thing. Let's say you change your mind and you just want to revert back to offering a good old fashioned course without any completion or expiration dates on it. You just go back to edit the certificate and then turn off the completed and expiration date. And then save the changes. Now, when I go back to the certificate as my test student and then hit refresh, the dates are gone. So these changes would reflect when your students download the certificate too. So it's really easy to come in here and make changes when you need to. You've now seen how to add a completed and expiration date to your MemberPress course certificates. See our knowledge base for more information on creating and selling online courses with MemberPress courses. Also, be sure to follow our blog and YouTube channel for all of our latest tips and tricks on all things MemberPress. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to like, subscribe, and check out our other videos that makes getting MemberPress up and running a breeze.